guys, Nick Silverstein here. Uh, I thought I would show you my new, my semi-new Dell computer. It's a Dell Latitude E6500. And by the way, yes, I bought a tripod. That's why you're getting better angles on uh, my videos. So this is my desk here. And I, I know it looks familiar because I used to have uh, my tower here. My tower is no longer here. And now it's in the dining room. I'll show you that probably in the next video or maybe a couple videos from there. And yes, I, because it's summer and school's over and everything, I plan on doing. I'm not going to say how many videos, but a lot of videos per week. I want to be doing a lot of videos per week and getting them out there and pushing them out there because uh, I know people like technology and it's really cool and I can't wait to show you guys all the technology I have because I have a lot of technology and I know you guys enjoy that. So let's turn it on and see what it can do. I missed the power button by like three seconds, by like three spaces. So, yes, it's an old Dell. I'll give you the specs. It's a Core 2 Duo, 2.26 gigahertz. Hang on, let me enter my password. It's 2.26 gigahertz, uh, Core 2 Duo. Came with Windows Vista. You can't really see that in frame. And yeah, it's running Windows 8.1 and it can run Windows 10. According to Dell, it can only run Windows 7 as the highest operating system, but that's not true at all. Um, it can run Windows 8, it can run Windows 8.1. You just have to go into Device Manager and download the graphics driver. Um, so these are all my apps. I have a lot of apps installed. I have Adobe Suite. I have my HP printer software, QuickTime, Roxio. I have Roxio 2012, Roxio NXT Pro. Uh, and, oh, I didn't mean to click that. Um, I also have Cyberlink Power DVD, and I don't know if you know this, guys, but I have a Blu ray drive installed in this machine. See, Blu ray RE. It can read and write Blu rays. Right here is the Blu ray drive. You can't really see that, but there's a Blu ray drive installed inside of this machine. There's no external Blu ray drive. Let me show you. you. Guys, really can't see the screen. Let me zoom in a little bit. Let me go up. Okay, hang on. Okay. Let's. I gotta loosen the tripod. Getting used to this new tripod. Okay, Windows 8.1 Pro with Media Center. Uh, this is a corporate copy uh, installed memory, six gigabytes. Yes, I have six gigabytes of RAM in here. 64-bit operating system, Dell E6500. Let me show you the specs. So the graphics card is an NVIDIA Quadro NVS 160M, which is pretty rocking, you know, 160M, it's decent for an old laptop like this. Uh, what else? I have Hallmark Card Studio. Uh, let's see if I can test a Blu-ray disc. Let me go find a Blu-ray disc and I'll... Oh, I'll be back with you. Uh, that's what I was pointing at down there. Sorry, I'm not really good with new tripods. Uh, give me a second to find a Blu-ray disc. 
Okay, I just found a Blu-ray disc. Spaceballs. Yes, on Blu-ray. Let's see if it will play. I know it won't play. I just want to make sure I see if you guys think it will play. Just to prove it to you guys that it has a Blu-ray. And it's really awesome. And this is like, this is really cool, you know. It's the 20th anniversary edition. So it has all the bonus features and everything. There comes up the Cyberlink Power Duty. Let me zoom out a little bit. Okay. And see Spaceballs comes up on the bottom. I'm going to turn off my sound so I don't get copyright infringement on YouTube. But I'll just show you a few parts. I decided I'm going to make a lot of videos on technology and stuff like that because it's really my passion. My passion is technology and I would love you guys to see all my struggles and achievements with technology. Um, I know YouTube people like that and stuff like that. Yeah, there goes the copyright. I think this is all I can show. I'll just show a little bit of this movie and that's about it. I can't really show much, but the sound does work. I'm just gonna skip through it. I really don't want to get copyright infringement. I might have to put this uh the screen backward in order for me to do that. Yeah, see so Blu-ray just play fine. Alright, that's about it I can show. But it's really awesome. And it... It's... This computer plays Blu-ray. Can't get any better than that. Um... This computer, because it has an NVIDIA graphics card... It's totally Mac compatible. Um... It's a Dell, it has a Core 2 Duo, and all these Core 2 Duo Dells have... Uh, have a uh, have Mac compatible, you know, the D six thirty is Mac compatible, the D eight thirty is Mac compatible, the E sixty five hundred is Mac compatible. I think the E sixty four hundred is Mac compatible, but you have to have an NVIDIA graphics card. And all these Dells are Mac compatible. Not every single Dell, but all the Dells I just mentioned are Mac compatible. Only if you have an NVIDIA graphics card. It's the only time they're Mac compatible. But <laughs> I love all Dells and I collect them and I take care of them. You know, I fix them up, I make them work. And there's one other thing I wanted to show you guys before I go, which is the screen resolution which is really high look at the screen resolution can you guys see that 1920 by 1200 it's huge absolutely massive so it's really awesome and it's a nice 16 by 10 aspect ratio it's like my favorite aspect ratio for all the stuff i do um Video editing I like to do on a 16 by 9 inch resolution, but audio editing, um, photo editing, word processing, and production, like um, graphic arts and stuff like that, I love to do on a 16 by 10 monitor. They're just absolutely bonkers. So I've rambled enough in this video. I'm going to post it uh, when I get a chance, and you should see me shortly. I plan on making a lot of videos very often, not every day, but not not like once a week. I hope, I hope to make it more than once a week, and I plan on doing it for as long as I can because it's summer, or almost summer, and my birthday's coming up, and my my uh, my video schedule. I have nothing to do, so I might as well make YouTube videos. 
So, it's really fun. It's been fun. I hope you guys enjoy it. Alright, have a nice day. See ya. Peace.